production of 155 millimeter howitzer ammunition in particular. So this mm. is an important contribution. And again, one that I strongly support. And by the way, the areas are already heavily dudded. They will have to be cleared. The Russian cluster bombs have a much higher failure rate, dud rate. There, this rate is considerably lower, 2.5 and below uh, percent. Uh, and so it, it keep in mind as well that this is Ukrainians deciding to use these munitions on their soil, not someone else's soil, in the process of liberating their territory. Put on your CIA director cap for a moment. What, what do you think went through Putin's mind today when President Biden declared that Putin has already lost the war? Well, Putin, of course, is still in denial. Um, he doesn't look in the mirror and yet and see a leader who made a catastrophically bad decision for his country that he set out to make Russia great again and really has made NATO great again. And of course, now we're going to see another member of NATO uh, join, adding Sweden to Finland already having joined as a result of this Russian invasion. And he doesn't yet acknowledge that Russia will not be able to out suffer the Ukrainians, the Europeans and the Americans. But that has to be creeping into his mind. The casualties have been enormous many, many times. The loss is just in the first year and a half that they took in a decade in Afghanistan, which was, of course, unsustainable. And now the bite on the economy is really starting as well. I'm sure you've seen uh, that their current account surplus was down by 93 percent over this year last time. Uh, so he's got problems at home. And then he has problems with this mutinous Wagner Group commander, uh, the loss of a, a very senior officer, the most senior uh, so far that you announced earlier, and of course the firing of one of his most popular frontline commanders, uh, Major General Popov, who commanded a little bit less than 30,000 Russians, uh, who, who played well with the troops. He was a very charismatic figure, had real flair. He, his call sign was Spartacus. He calls his soldiers gladiators, and he was complaining to his higher headquarters about the inadequacies of their provision of support for him, in particular with the lack of firefinder radars that enable, enable them to conduct accurate counterfire against the Ukrainians uh, and a number of other issues uh, that he raised to them. And so they fired him. That These are not heartening signs if you are overseeing this operation from the Kremlin. Retired four-star general David Petraeus, good to see you, sir. Thanks so much. Coming up next.